At Fountain Buster, we've created fountains for a variety of different social networks. The thing is, social networks and other sites are frequently on the lookout for bot behavior. So, to protect your account and stay under the radar, you should always be trying to reproduce human behavior with your phantoms. Here are a few best practices that will help you do that. First, always start slowly and warm up your account, meaning that you build up the amount of actions you're doing over time, especially if you weren't super active on your account before. Secondly, always spread your actions out throughout the day, meaning that you do things in small batches at different time intervals and try to keep your launches within daytime hours. Thirdly, be aware of rate limits. Social networks put a limit on the number of actions you can make per day in order to detect automation, so try not to exceed them. Let's introduce you briefly to what those look like for different sites. Starting with LinkedIn, it really depends on what action you're doing. For example, a profile visiting action, such as LinkedIn Profile Scraper, LinkedIn Network Booster, or LinkedIn Message Sender, we'd recommend processing a maximum of 80 profiles per day, or 150 if you have a sales navigator or other premium account. Otherwise, if you're extracting lists, such as using a LinkedIn search export, a LinkedIn contacts extractor, or a LinkedIn post commenters phantom, you can do a lot more. You should also be aware that with LinkedIn, it's really important that you try to keep your launches within working hours since it's a social network that's primarily for business. So again, we're trying to reproduce human behavior. With other social networks, similar rules apply. With more direct actions on Instagram, we'd recommend a maximum of one per hour because they're really very strict when it comes to rate limits. Otherwise, when you're extracting lists, you can do a lot more. You can extract between 5,000 to 9,000 results per launch and you can launch these phantoms multiple times throughout the day. With Facebook, again, with more direct actions, we recommend restricting the amount you're doing per hour, depending on which phantom you're using. But with extracting lists, you can reach up to about four to 5,000 results per source that you're taking the results from, such as a group or a selection of post likers. And finally, with Twitter, it really depends on how warmed up and active your account is, but you can make approximately 50 to 80 actions per day if they're things like follows or retweets or likes. And once again, for extractions, you'll be able to access four to 5,000 results per launch, spreading these launches throughout the day. If you happen to exceed any of these limits, you may be disconnected by the social network. You may even be given a warning, but don't worry too much. Simply bring down the amount of actions you're doing and make sure that you're respecting the limits. Keep an eye out for updates on these on our blog. In the meantime, be safe with your automation. This will help you enjoy Phantom Buster to the fullest. Take care.